okay we are live hi friends welcome back to my channel welcome to this week's vlog um if you can't tell by the quality honey we've got a new camera okay so i was determined to get a new camera i know that i mentioned it in my last vlog i'm de i was determined to get a new camera because vlogging on my phone just was not giving what needed to be gave here i go again with the weekly hands to my hair i get my hair done tomorrow y'all so hopefully i won't be touching my hair as much but i'm in the bathroom sorry because he's on the game and he's being kind of loud and i wanted to be able to talk to you guys but anyway, so yes, we got a new camera, we're lit, we're happy about it. Um, so no more vlogging on my phone. We're gonna do just top tier vlogging only, top tier vlogging only. So basically, um, that's all I've done today. I was up all night comparing cameras and then I ordered one last night from Target and I had to drive all the way out to a Target in like Beaufort or Swanee or whatever that area is called. Um, Sorry, I had to go all the way to a Target out there because the Targets near me did not have anything in stock. And I really wanted my camera this weekend because I have some things planned. And so I wanted to give you guys like good quality vlogging with the activities that I'm going to be partaking in this weekend. So, yeah. Okay, I'm back. I had to take a phone call because just a lot of things are going on in your girl's life. I'm getting laser hair removal, okay? Might be TMI, but I mean, we all friends. So anyway, um, y'all see all this hair on my head? Yeah, it's like that the rest of my body and I'm over it. So we're not, mm -mm. it's gotta go, it's gotta go. But anyway, got a new camera. What was I talking about? I got distracted, so now I don't really know. But anyway, I don't really have a whole bunch of plans today, but I have some plans this weekend that I definitely wanted the camera for. I wanted to give you guys good quality vlogging content because I want to really put my all into the vlogging. Like, I really, really do. So I feel like I've got all my little things now, all my ducks in a row. So I'm really going to do my best to give you guys some amazing content. Sorry I look so rough. This is how I woke up. Okay. Um. Anyway. I need to go to the gym um and then I'll probably I'll, I've been wanting to go to home goods and um like TJ Maxx because I'm looking for some home decor y'all see our messy bed in the back don't judge us but um I've been looking for some home decor because you guys know that I kind of recently just moved back to Atlanta back home and so we have our apartment and we are still kind of getting things together in terms of um, decoration. I don't know if I've showed you guys everything. Let me see. Okay, y'all, so please do not judge. My camera's about to die. I gotta charge, but don't judge the messiness. So, basically, this is our bathroom so far. I added this artwork, and it's from Society6, and then I bought, like, another of the retro, um, what is this retro ad mixed with like modern day celebrities i bought one with lauren hill and so i was gonna put that on that wall you know but we couldn't really the frame the set that we bought these frames the other one was broken so yeah so i haven't put it up yet i really actually don't know if i like this frame y'all tell me what y'all think it's from walmart it looks okay on camera i guess you know but it feels really cheap to me because we have some really nice frames that are going in the big hallway and I think that's what I was comparing it to. But yeah, so then we have shower curtain. Um, I was going to get like a rug to put here. Yeah, y'all see that? Y'all see that nonsense? My little animal did that to me. Just, just, I'm abusing this household. And then we just recently, please don't judge y'all, but we just recently got our bed. If you can see it, it's from Living Spaces. And it, it kind of just got here like late late last month so this is our bed and then i ended up getting this um duvet from amazon basics and i really thought it was a lighter color y'all and it came a little orange and at first i didn't know if i liked it because i didn't know if it went along with the color of the bed but i think i've grown to love it and then um in my i don't know i didn't get to post this because it was going to be in my very first vlog but then 
my stuff wouldn't upload we also got these like big pillows these are orange from um target and so when the bed's all made y'all it looks super cute it looks a little ghetto right now please do not look don't judge okay we literally just woke up and started our day and then we have an extra pillow on the floor that's the hard pillow he doesn't like it so he doesn't sleep with it and then the sheets are kind of like <sighs> rolling off the side of the bed but we also got like this little box cover box spring cover from amazon basics too so yeah I'm happy that our bed came. It makes me feel like the room is just a little bit more complete. I'm going to get some nightstands that I want to put one in that corner and then one in his corner. And then do some serious nightstand de decorations, you know. And then we also got, don't judge, that's his closet. Okay, don't judge that. We also got um, this floor mirror from Ikea, which I kind of want to put on the wall. Like I kind of want it to be sitting on the wall and kind of create a look condense this space a little bit more because this as you can see is a very small room so I want to kind of condense the space as much as possible so I'm thinking about putting that on the wall and then we have our two closets this one's mine and I the closet decor like I'm not even going to show you the closet it doesn't look as bad as his but the closet like I have to work on the storage for that as well because that's what's driving me insane too but yeah that's what I'm working on so far um, as of right now. And then we have this long hallway. I really haven't given y'all like an apartment tour, but I will as time goes on. Um, and I also have, if you want to keep up to date with like what I'm doing with our apartment um, on my Instagram, I have a home highlight. So if you want to see like any new additions that we get, so on and so forth, you can check it out there. Um, this used to be um a soap jar and i had them filled all the way up and it was for decoration at first but then we just started like using the supply and so we now only have one soap bar left and we don't even use the soap bar we use like now we use the body wash from target i'm gonna show y'all let me show y'all hold on i don't know if y'all ever used this but this stuff is like crack okay and so i'm gonna go to target today too at some point and i want to get another like smell because this smells so good y'all it literally smells like oatmeal it smells like you just smell like shea butter oatmeal you smell very what's that like i don't want to say grainy that doesn't sound attractive it, you just smell very like soft and warm with this one and but there are some other ones that i saw and i definitely think i'm gonna get those too Hi friends, so I had to charge my camera battery um, before I could finish recording earlier, but I just took a shower, got dressed, and I put on like a little fit. I'm about to just put on like some slight makeup because like I said, I'm going to get drinks with a friend tonight. Let me show you guys what I'm wearing, hold on. So I don't really know how I feel about this fit, honestly, but I just have on some, sorry about the dirty mirror y'all, but some Levi's shorts. And then this thrifted Guns N' Roses tea. And no, before y'all ask, I don't listen to Guns N' Roses. I just like the t-shirts. Um, but and then I also have on my thigh-high Zara boots. I don't know if you guys can see. Sorry. I need a full-length mirror in here. But yeah. So that's all I got on. I'm probably going to throw on a little jacket. I can't figure out if I want this shirt tucked or like maybe like that. Maybe like that. I don't know. I'm probably going to throw on a little jacket. My little green um, military um, jacket from Urban Outfitters. Um, I don't know if I like this fit, y'all. Like, I want to like it, but I don't know if I do, you know. I don't know if I'm feeling it. My sister said it's cute, so I'm just rolling with it for now. But yeah, that's what I'm wearing to dinner. I mean, not to dinner, drinks. And then, yeah. I will definitely be taking y'all to drinks with me, of course. And then I'm trying to find a mood afterwards. One thing about me, y'all, on my off days, like when I'm not at work, I really like to make the most out of my days off because if you don't, then time flies by and then you gotta go back to work and you didn't do anything. So yeah, so I'm just gonna go out for some drinks, catch up with my old friend and then me and Kenny are thinking about something to possibly do tonight. I'm not really trying to get into too much. Like I'm not trying to be out on the town really, but I, I just don't want to be like sitting at home. 
sorry y'all like if y'all not used to me picking up my hair by now honestly like this is all that i do this is all that i do so yeah i don't know if i like this outfit i had like another t-shirt option but i don't know i'm feeling really like heavy because i am it's my time of the month so everything about me feels heavy big thick and i just feel like ugh, all the time and i feel like i look ugh, you know so i don't know i don't know if i want to wear this or not but i think it's like cute but i don't really know but anyway i'm gonna put on just some light makeup real quick i need to get my brows done because they're starting to look a little messy yeah I need to get my brows done. Honestly, y'all, the hardest part about keeping like lashes and nails and brows is the maintenance. Like, you gotta routinely do it. I wish I could just do it once and then just be like that be it. You know, like I never have to do it again. But <sighs> that's unfortunately not how life works. So, yeah. So I'm just going to put on probably like a little bit of concealer to hide these marks. And then I'll probably just, I don't think I'm going to do my brows. I've just been using the, let me show you, the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Free Styling Gel. Looks like this. Let me see if that'll zoom. Uh, there we go. It looks like that. I usually use that to just kind of like shape my brows and keep them. I like that, that like trendy look right now with the feathered brows because it looks real natural and i think natural is my look so yeah y'all i don't know what to do with this shirt like it's not staying first of all and i keep tucking it in and then like taking it out i don't know what my issue is but yeah so anyway yeah i'm about to just do a little makeup and then before I go meet her, I think I'm gonna run to Home Goods because it's something I've been meaning to do for a while. And here, I'm actually gonna sit you guys down. There we go. Y'all can kind of see me better. Sorry, I gotta like lean down a little bit to be in the camera. I don't know if I'm focused though. Focus on me. There we go, kind of sort of. Yeah, okay, there we go. I gotta kind of lean down a little bit because this is not my bigger tripod. Um, I don't feel like going out there to get my other tripod. But yeah, so this is pretty much, let me see if y'all can see the fit a little bit. Better. Oh, no, you can't. I don't feel like fixing the camera. But anyway, yeah. I must just put on some makeup real quick. I'm just in here chilling, watching a little SVU while I'm gonna do my makeup. And then when I come back home, well, later today, later this evening, I need to wash my hair for my hair appointment in the morning, um, which is another thing that I'm not the biggest fan of doing because I got a lot of hair and I hate, like, I should have washed my hair like early in the day, honestly, because I hate going to bed with wet hair. That is the most disgusting feeling to me ever in life. I'm not a fan. So yeah, that's just, mm, I got a lot to do, technically. Like a lot of things, and it's what time? I'm supposed to be meeting her at 7:30, so I need to um, put makeup on and then go to Home Goods because y'all already know how Atlanta traffic be working. And I ain't got time to be playing games with nobody. Plus, it's a Friday too. Let me see how far the drive is right now. Yes, 20 minutes away. Yeah, 20 minutes away. So yeah, let me go ahead and get dressed. I mean, let me go ahead and put some slight makeup on so I can get ready to go. Okay y'all, so this is what we got going on. Can't really see. Here's the, the boots, the shorts, the shirt, the jacket. That's kind of what we got going on. My makeup, hold on, it's too dark in here. I'm not a fan. I don't know why this one is being weird. Don't want to open. Anyway, by now y'all should know my makeup doesn't really look like much. I just like, I really didn't do anything. I don't really look that different, but I just added a few little things and yeah. So, I don't know, I'm actually kind of hungry. So I'm gonna try to figure that out. 
um because i think we're just going to get a drink at the garden room because it's kind of hard to get seating and then i've heard mixed reviews about the food so i'm not planning on eating there um it's just a quick meeting for a quick drink and yeah that's pretty much it and i was gonna run home good but i kind of don't feel like it i feel, i kind of feel like sitting down i feel like i've been on the go since I got up this morning. And I'm actually like a little sleepy. I need a nap. So yeah. Come here, sit down. Come here. Come here. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. Okay y'all, so I got here uh, before Iman, so I'm just parked in the parking lot, just waiting for her to get here so we can walk over together. And um, it's busting on a Friday night in Bucket. Hella cars out here. Hella people out here. Hold on, let me zoom out. Why y'all so close to me? Anyway, hella cars, hella people. So it's definitely a mood, a vibe to be out tonight. Um, and honestly, like, I like when it's busy like this because it makes me happy to be home. It feels like even if I don't do something, I'm a part of something. You know, I don't know. If that sounds lame or whatever but i just really enjoy being out and enjoying like life you know i spent so long or so much time like in school and working and so i had no social life and i spent so much time like in a different city so i didn't have many friends and it was like i i never really got to enjoy myself really um and now that i'm in my career and i'm back home in my comfort zone my comfort area i feel like i'm enjoying my life a little bit more i could be being dramatic though y'all but that's just how i've been feeling and it just i like me being out on the town or whatever just really makes me more appreciative of like being from atlanta and being from and living in such having the means to live in such a uh like busy air i don't want to say busy but such a like popping area you know let me lock my doors because i'm just sitting in my vehicle but yeah the only thing though is y'all like everybody got these nice ass cars and i'm over here in my 2010 chevy malibu like your girl wants a new vehicle okay but i'm trying my best to hold out i do not need a new car like i said in my last one like i'm just not trying to paint no note but i really don't need a new car like i really like my car's fine you know um it's just like I've had it for so long and it's like over a decade old that it is run down. But if I took better care of my car, honestly, I would be more appreciative. I feel like like I need to get my front bumper fixed because I got in a car accident probably almost two years ago and never got it fixed. And then I need to get the inside cleaned. And I actually know a guy, so I'm probably going to do that pretty soon. But yeah, I don't know. That's my spiel. So yeah. I'm kind of getting sleepy. I'm trying to train myself to go to sleep later at night because my next, I'm switching to night shift um, next week. And that is going to be, I am in night shift in like three years, y'all. So that's going to be an adjustment. And I'm already tired. I stay, I made myself stay up to like, like three in the morning last night okay normally i go to bed at like 11 so um but anyway i stayed up till like three in the morning last night um and then i went to sleep got up at eight right so and then i was like, i'm gonna take naps throughout the day but i've just been kind of on go like busy moving around which i really ain't did nothing today so i don't know why but anyway so now i'm kind of like i think i got like a sleep headache because i have like a low grade headache and um i didn't take any naps today which i think i should have done that because now i'm kind of sleepy and i don't want to go to bed early because then that throws off my whole little plan of going to sleep later and hoping to get up later or take like force myself to take naps throughout the day so that i'm well rested by the time that i start my night shift because y'all like if you've never worked night shift that's a whole different ball game okay it is not for the week like also let's i mean i used to wake up like from my sleep after getting off work and feel like i got hit by a truck okay like my body would be aching 
I would be like my brain would be foggy like I'm not my body of course our bodies are not used to whew, our bodies are not used to sleeping like that or being up like that so it was an adjustment and it took me I worked night shift for like a year and a half when I was a tech so it took me that whole year and a half to really get acclimated and then I switched to day shift so I don't know but honestly I don't think I went about it the right way back in the day because I, I did not like pr prioritize my sleep I'm stuttering I know how to talk y'all sorry I did not prioritize my sleep and then I was like overworking myself too because I was in school and then I was also working and then I had a terrible lifestyle. Like, I did not work out. I did not eat healthy. I ate bad every single day. I ate out every single day. So, I felt like shit because I was, you know, not doing shit. So, I think this go around with me being, like, super active or a lot more, yeah, super active, a lot more active than I recently was or previously was, eating a lot better, even though, you know, I've been eating like trash these last couple of months, but in general i eat a lot better than i did three years ago and um prioritizing my sleep better like i don't have class first thing in the morning anymore like i literally just go to work like an adult so i think that will make it a little bit easier let me scoot or at least that's what i'm hoping i'm hoping that i don't like struggle going to night shift because i don't want to um my bad, John. I don't want to, um, I don't know. I don't want it to, like, affect my work. You know what I'm saying? So, I gotta, I'm trying to make sure that I'm doing better. But, um, yeah. So, I'm just waiting on Iman to let me know that she's here so we can walk over. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I'm hungry. So, I might place an order at Velvet Taco this week. Might be getting Velvet Taco again. Because I'm hungry, y'all. Like, I had breakfast, I had lunch, um, and then I had a croissant and like a couple uh, kernels of popcorn, but I'm hungry, so yeah, but I don't know if I should wait for Kenny to eat before I eat, because I don't know if he plans on like, because I told him I don't really want to sit in the house tonight, but I really don't know what we're going to do, you know, like there's really not much i know i say there's really not much there's a lot to do in atlanta y'all we are just not like lounge club every weekend type people we're not buy bottles pop bottles get sections every weekend type of people that's not what we do we're more of like go to the movies uh go bowling we're one of those types of couples you know so yeah but a lot of a lot of times like those things you kind of got to be in the mood for so I don't know. I don't know. We're going to see. I am tired, like I said, but I don't want to like go home and be tired because then I'm just going to go to, I'm just going to go to sleep. I know I am. So yeah. Y'all, I'm staring at this Jeep wagon parked in front of me. And when I tell y'all it's beautiful, like it's like God is like, get a new car, get a new car, get a new car. But I know I don't need a new car. I know I don't need one. I know I don't need one. I know it. I know it. We know it. You know it. I do not need a new vehicle. So, oh, another G-Wagon. This one black. The one parked in front of me is white. And a black one just pulled in looking fabulous. I don't I don't see G-Wagons as much as I used to. I don't know if they're, like, as popular. But I really, I've always really liked them. I always thought they were super nice. And I've been, I know I said I'm not going to get a new car, so, you know. But, like, I have been thinking about, like, the type of car I would get. And I don't know if I would do just like a Kia or like the new Honda, the what is it, Hyundai, Hyundai, whatever. Those are really nice. They look very luxurious, you know, for regular schmegular pricing because, baby, I'm not no millionaire, you know. Wait a minute, I think this is in mine. I'm here. Yeah, it does. I was wondering, are those all real plants or are they like fake plants? We both. <laughs> I don't know, Iman. I think I'm going to order food. I'm nervous. 
you are gonna order food? I'm probably just gonna order that lobster roll or that spicy onion. I'm gonna ask first. What's better? I don't know. That lobster roll did look good, kinda. I might, like, if I can just order some fries. <laughs> Something. Fries? I was thinking about just getting fries. fries too. Too. Yeah. Such a cute area. The lighting isn't bad over here either. All right, good morning, y'all. It is currently like, what, six, seven in the morning. I'm on my way to my hair appointment. I had to stop at Starbucks first. Um, yeah, so I we went out to Garden Room last night. They wouldn't let me record in the restaurant. They don't allow like photography or videography or whatever in this um, in the restaurant. So I couldn't take you guys with me inside. But we ended up waiting for like an hour to get inside. Um, I was starving, so we almost peaced out. But we ended up going in, and um, it was nice. You know, the drinks. It, but it was really nice basically the drinks were good um i heard that the food wasn't good but i ordered food because i was hungry and it wasn't bad at all i got like the sliders and the truffle fries it was actually pretty good so overall we had a good time but now um i'm on my way to my hair appointment i got, ended up since we had to wait an hour to get in um and then we didn't leave till like 11 12 mm, like 11 um by the time i got home I was just exhausted, so I didn't end up washing my hair. So I'm gonna have Rachel wash my hair this morning. Um, so I'm trying to get to my appointment on time because I'm not trying to be uh, prolonging my my retie, you know. So yeah. Uh, so I'm just sitting in the Starbucks parking lot because I have to pick up my my Starbeezies because I'm I ain't had nothing this morning and I'm kind of dead. Um, and I got the pumpkin spice. Lot, not latte pumpkin spice cold brew fire you guys i had never had it to this year fire okay somebody put me on um at work change your life it's delicious it's delicious so yeah but let me head to this hair appointment and i will check in with you guys when we get there so i'm currently at the salon oh what's that <laughs> you are so annoying <laughs> <laughs> she put on mascara for the vlog y'all <laughs> Oh my gosh. That's that real content though, for real, for real. Yes, yeah. Ooh, this lighting is very great. This channel, you're doing me right. That's what everybody really wants. Yes, to this lighting. This think is we great. Like, uh, look, we cousins. So. <laughs> I, can't. I got two little bundle braids in the front. <laughs> and I'm over here stopping. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't <laughs> But yeah, so we're at the salon, you guys. Say hi to everybody. Hi, everybody. This is Rachel again. Hi. And look at nice to meet you guys. She's hilarious. I'm the lactician. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we're all done. All done with the retype. So, so next. Yes. <laughs> so we're gonna. I don't think I'm gonna go to this pole class. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm just gonna go eat and pee. <laughs> All right, let me turn. Okay, y'all. So, see, my hair is done. Look at this. Look at this length. Look at this volume, honey. It's giving what needs to be given. Okay, I love getting my hair done. I love being with Rachel. We have the greatest conversation. She's such a great person to be around. Hopefully, she watches this. I love you, Rachel, girl. I do. Um, but yeah, so I was gonna go to the pole dancing class and I was thinking because my class, I mean, my hair appointment was so early that I'd be able to make it. But unfortunately, like the salon, let me try to get some good lighting for y'all. The salon, like location versus where I'm at right now, it's like 36 minutes away. Y'all know how Atlanta traffic be, okay? And so I can't go to the class, which 
you know sucks so um i'm hoping like we could possibly meet for lunch or something later because i still want to see my girls you know i still want to see the girls so yeah i don't know i'm about to just go home i guess until the class is over and they have some free time so yeah but look at this hair y'all my hair's still wet sorry because she washed it for me but my hair is getting long. I'm getting some inches, y'all. And I'm very, very excited about it. Very happy about the inches that I'm giving. Look at Rachel. I don't think she saw me. But yes, my hair always looks super long after my reties. But let me show y'all. Look. It always looks super long. So, um, sorry, my group message is blowing up. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of sad. I wanted to get something, you know, I wanted to see everybody. And of course, it's my ass that can't get everything together. I just, you know, like we book our hair appointments way in advance, like weeks out. And so this pole dancing class, pole dancing class just kind of popped up and I was thinking I could really make it. <laughs> but I was double booked. I'm double booked. Also, don't judge me because I had on the shirt I had on yesterday. Okay. I woke up at the crack of ass, dawn, whatever crack acid on and threw this on with some leggings and was out the door because I needed to be at the hair salon because y'all know that I went out last night and I ain't go to bed till late and so y'all know I didn't wash my hair and I had to get my coffee honey had to get my coffee so yeah I don't know y'all I don't know what the move is gonna be today my ch plans have completely rearranged hopefully I can still meet up with the girls um or something afterwards because I was excited for y'all to see everybody you know but it's my fault it's my bad my bad my be so yeah i'm about to just head home and then figure out what my plans are going to be from there could i have the nachos olay i know it's an appetizer i just wanted uh, oh okay can i have um oh it's a bee oh <laughs> Okay, it's like that TikTok be like, I'm back, y'all life was boring, y'all be sleep without me, you know? I gotta bring the heat. <laughs> what are you doing? May I please get the... Uh, Not may I please. <laughs> Not may I please. I got manners, I don't know about Okay, may I please. Oh, you ordered? There it is. Oh. Okay, what kind of meat would you like? Chicken bowl and then Mexican rice or cilantro rice. All right. Hello, everybody. Look at this. You know, with my day ones, per usual. Yeah, mimosa time. Mimosa time. Uh huh. And that peach is so <laughs> this bitch is for some peaches. You got nachos on that. Nachos Shut up. Thank you. I'm so hot. Okay, so let's go. 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 let I'm obviously at brunch with Z gals. Which which one do you like? Most of the time. Yeah. Well, what? Yeah, I don't want to just do it. How big is this person? Fifteen dollars. How big is this? <laughs> they gonna get the tail. All right. You gonna get the ass. You gonna get the booty. That's what you gonna get. It's rampy with this camera. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be rampy every event. Yup. Period. You gotta fuck the life, okay? Listen, when you start bringing the big bucks, just cut me off like. Girl, cut you off. Cut me off like a little, little meal. You can take me out the end. 1%.
<laughs> we waiting on two more people, right? Just yeah. tag me in the post. Just tag me in the post. So I can just repost. So, y'all are so funny. Okay, y'all, so I'm um, home, obviously. Back from the restaurant uh, some hours ago. It's later in the day. We were at the restaurant for some hours because it was bottomless mimosas. So we were drinking and laughing and being loud and just enjoying our time. And then we all decided that we want to go out tonight. So I'm about to start getting dressed to go meet over Reyes because we are going to Uber together. Um, and I think we're gonna go to Edgewood and kind of like figure out where we want to be, what spot we want to be at. Our original plan was to go to 11:45, but it was kind of last minute, and we didn't like you kind of need like a section of 11:45. We didn't have all that planned out, and it wasn't sounding like everybody could come together for that. So we chose something that was more like easily accessible. So that's our move for tonight. So I'm about to get dressed. Um, yeah, I have to come home, recoup, take a nap. Sorry y'all, I'm looking at this frog on my window. I had to take a nap, um, cause y'all know I'm trying to get my night shift sleep schedule together. And um, I just need to take a little quick nap so that I can be rejuvenated for the festivities tonight. Like be, have my head in the game, you know, cause I'm tired. So yeah, I'm about to get dressed. I kind of have an idea of what I want to wear, not really sure. I think I'm about to just try to put something together real quick. I think I'm gonna wear my boots again because it's slightly chilly. And I've never been to Edgewood, but from what they have explained to me, it's kind of, you like kind of outside a little bit. It's kind of like bar hopping. So I don't think I want to be cold. So I'm, I don't know. I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna put on. And I just put my scarf on and kind of lay my edges because every time I get a fresh re retie after I lay, put a scarf on and lay my edges down, they come all real soft and sweet. And I don't think I'm putting no makeup on. I just really don't feel like it. I might do something to these brows because they are atrocious. I need to get my brows done ASAP. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it, y'all. I'm about to just get dressed. I'm trying to figure out what I want to wear. I'm trying to figure out what the vibes are. Y'all know it's a little chilly in Atlanta now because um, fall has kicked in. So I'm trying to figure out, I don't know. I'm trying to figure my life out right now. That's pretty much all that I'm doing. That's pretty much it. Good morning, friends. So, let's start by saying I did not end up going out last night. Thanks to my friends who fell asleep after mimosas and brunch and all that and just did not move for the rest of the day. So we did not end up going out last night to Edgewood. I was disappointed because I wanted to go. I was trying out my outfits. I was trying to figure out my moves. And we did not end up going. So, yeah, we just ended up staying in and watching the first episode of BMF, um, which I fell asleep, so. And I just woke up this morning and dressed to go out. Um, since I didn't vlog yesterday, I kinda wanna just move around a little bit more today to have, um, don't judge the trash up there, okay y'all, but move around a little bit more today to have some things to show you guys. So yeah, and I'm actually gonna start editing this vlog um, in a little bit. So yeah, I'm just waiting on him to get dressed so we can go and start our day. So that's pretty much it. All right, y'all, so I didn't record at Buttermilk. I didn't record the food, but it was good. If, you, if you've never had Buttermilk, it's like breakfast. It's like breakfast food, brunch. Um, we did have an hour wait. And I tried to make a reservation beforehand, but they don't take any reservations. Um, so you just kind of got to show up. Um, but yeah, so now... I don't know where we're headed. I think we might be heading home. But I play it. Take pictures. Yeah. Well, never mind. We're going to West Midtown so I can get some pictures taken for the week. 
for upcoming week. I also want to rent lemons, lemons, and yeah, Ooh, that car's nice. But yeah, just a regular schmegular Sunday, chilling. It's a perfect day. The weather is perfect. Um, I think I would rather the weather stay like this instead of getting cold. Super nice out today, so I'm trying to be outside and enjoy this great weather for the time being before we gotta go back to work. We're at West Side Provisions, you guys. Let me show y'all the scenery. bunch of restaurants and stores mostly restaurants and then like the Jenny's ice cream over there you guys um, it's actually pretty close to us it's the perfect day to be outside in this environment I think I'm gonna run a little women though I kind of want to cross the bridge and just look because we've never been across the bridge this lighting sorry y'all Never been across the bridge, so I think I want to kind of cross the bridge and then go see what's on the other side. We've mostly only been on like this side of the plaza. This is such a pretty area. Where's the area toward? Oh, yes, yeah, we good for some pictures, but the area towards like Lulu. You know? Do you know how to get over there? Yeah, just trying to get it. Such a beautiful area, y'all. With the lights. Wait, what scene are you? Ooh, right here. Oop. I don't know. This is not what I'm looking for. My favorite store. This is what I'm looking for. Down here. Yeah. Yes, this is what I'm looking for. <laughs> Over here. I'm getting distracted. Yeah. yeah. Sit. Yep, this is what I'm looking for. These are cute. Six, six. Oh my crap. This color is cute. Well, that's a four. Hold on, y'all. Let me not mess everything up. Mess up their folding. No, I'm okay. Thank you. Cute. I like these. Oh, I think I got these other colors. Just keeps getting black. I don't think I can do an eight. Six, six, six seven, eight. Oh, wait a minute. Six. Mm -hmm. These are, I want these. Jesus, if I can take them out. That's what you're saying? Yeah. Thank you. 
Oh no, never mind. I lied about that. At Ulta. So the light is bad at Ulta. <laughs> Okay. Sorry. That's okay. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Who is the hair product set? I just needed. I just needed the Sunday to Sunday like Meissler water, guys. You know, like it's like a dry shampoo almost, but not a dry shampoo. Because I need something that's gonna help me, like, um, like wash my hair in between retries and. I need something that's not going to cause buildup. Let's see. I don't know if I'm seeing anything. Let's see. Because I have to be careful about what I put in my hair so that I don't have buildup or cause slippage with my locks. And so I'm just looking for something that's going to like kind of clean my scalp without me having to. Y'all know what I'm trying to say, right? Without me having to do the most. And I liked that that brand had like a Meissler water. But I guess. They don't have that in store. Which is disappointing. Yeah, see, I don't think they have anything like what I'm looking for. I don't want a mask. See, this is dry shampoo. Let's see. For light hair though, what's the difference? This is yeah, that's for light hair. I don't see anything like it. I really don't see many brands that I like know of I'm not, I'm not really looking for let me see I don't even mind trying a different brand I just need something the tangle spray shampoo I just need something So I picked this up. I don't know if this is what I'm looking for. Or something like this. I really think I might just wait to see if they have what I'm looking for. Or just come back, you know? Because I don't think this is it. And I don't want to buy something and then not like it. Let's see. And I can't really get anything that's moisturizing. I need something that's going to clean my hair. Yeah, y'all don't think this is it. 
I'm not seeing anything. So I think I'm gonna wait. Did not have what I needed in there, so I'm just looking around right now. I think I need to go this way to go to Home Goods. I just wanted to look in Home Goods. All right, y'all. So let's zoom out. <laughs> um, they didn't have what I needed in Ulta. So I'm going to see if I can buy it online and then just have it shipped or maybe pick it up from that location. But basically, I don't know if I think Sunday to Sunday is like a newer brand. It's black owned natural hair care from what I believe. Um, and basically what I want is like the Meissler water. So to help me like refresh my hair, keep my hair kind of like cleaner or whatever um, in between reties because i'm not good about washing my hair which i could be better so i'm probably gonna start trying to be better um i'm waiting for the day that i can like buy shampoo and conditioner again because i can use only use shampoo right now and then rachel is like we gotta wait a little bit before i use conditioner because we don't want my locks to slip out um which i mean you can see they're pretty like locked but like there's some like around my edges and stuff that like if they get wet or too soft they'll slip out just because of my hair texture so yeah um i kind of like this lighting right here i don't know sorry y'all this is kind of a hot mess but yeah then i went into home goods didn't really see anything and so i just came back home because i'm kind of feeling hot and like bothered i think i'm tired I like i need to take a little nap and uh, yeah that's pretty much it i know like this vlog was not the most eventful and i was supposed to do a lot more than i actually did um but plans got canceled and rearrange and stuff but thank y'all for sticking with me anyway riding with me anyway um sorry y'all i'm hoping that next week vlog will be just a tad bit more eventful um and i'll just have some more to like show you guys talk to you guys about um i'm gonna have to go in here and like start editing this vlog and then planning out a content calendar so that I have um, consistent content to produce for you guys but yeah that it's just been my week honestly my weekend <laughs> um, I never got my brows done so there's that definitely do that but I, my energy is just not there it might have to be a later this week task honestly I don't know how much worse they can get but yeah anyway this is me ending the vlog. So, thank you guys for watching. Make sure that you subscribe. Sorry. That's loud. This is basically me ending the vlog. So, thank you for watching. Make sure that you guys subscribe. Make sure that you follow me on Instagram. Make sure that you stay up to date with everything that I've got going on. And I will see you guys next week.